A few weeks ago, I posted a picture on the TV44 Facebook page holding a throat coat tea bag, asking, how do you get rid of a cold? We asked you on our Facebook page and we got some answers. And so today, Patrick Hamler and Andy Lynch are going to attempt to test these out. Oh no, <laughs> that's what we're here for? <laughs> Guinea pigs. I thought Guinea pigs. Guinea got it, pig. okay, yeah. Well, <laughs> this is not a cake segment. The goal is <laughs> to keep you guys healthy. There's honey and cinnamon? I am cinnamon? desiring for you to be healthy. There's Thank not healthy you. things in cake? Honey and cinnamon? <laughs> Lemon? Mm -hmm. So we received quite a few different responses from people on our Facebook page. And if you aren't one of our Facebook friends, today's a good day to do that. Krista said essential oils, and so did Roseanne. In fact, Roseanne suggested taking tea tree oil, putting it in boiling water, and in, like and inhaling breathing it? it in. <laughs> breathing it in. That's it? That's it. Oh. Do I have to like, let it like percolate for a while, or just drop it in and go? I can I smell it from here. Now we only did like one or two drops. You wafted in. We don't teaching? really know what Boston. the what. Yeah, like they teach you in chemistry class. Yeah, you don't you, inhale you, it directly. You want to? I don't have a cold. <laughs> you don't have a cold. It worked, huh? But I didn't have one before, so oh. I don't know. So you're not a good candidate for this, huh? We should have brought sick people in here before we did this. What's another way that we can potentially cause ourselves to is get it better? Time for the cake if yet. tea tree is not your way, well, we're gonna bring something sweet in. Oh. Honey. Oh. <laughs> All right. Honey's good. All right. So we had, Sorry to kill your mood we had there, several Andy. people talk about creating your own tea. What do I do? Involving honey, lemon, and cinnamon. Some just said a lemon slice. Joan said a lemon slice and honey. She called it hot lemonade. Eric says Ooh. a big heaping tablespoon of cinnamon and honey. Um, other people mentioned it as well. So let's see how easy it is to create a drink of Honey, lemon, and cinnamon. So how about if I watch my watch oh, and man. see if you can make this happen in what? 30 seconds. go. Not difficult, huh? So do you guys no. think you could do this at home? I think so. Without I think TV I cameras? Do I don't know if I could. <laughs> How would I do that? <laughs> Couple other uh, you drink suggestions it? Like, that I, came right, to us. You're holding it. Becky says we should, you should gargle with Listerine. Joni uh -oh. says you should take silver and use olive leaf. I've got olive leaf How do you take silver? Right here. Wait a second. Let's go back to that Oh, one. if you don't know anything about silver, you Andy, that's a silver? whole nother discussion that we could talk about. Are you being serious? I am being serious. Huh. I'm serious. Hey, Ch this isn't bad. Chad mentions Flonase. <laughs> Cindy says the Brock's real lemon drops that you can get at Old Time Pantry in Elida. Roseanne mentions Airborne. And uh, Sherry Kettner, who we will always oh. love, suggests you move to Florida. And that's how she says you stay well. So this is our last segment. We're going to move to Florida. <laughs> We'll see you next year <laughs> when it's warm. If you have suggestions on how you can stay well this winter, just drop them into our comments section and let us know because we want to hear more. And we'll make it for you.